Hi everybody, it's Sherry Sicard, AKA Cannabis Sherry, and I'm here today because it's housekeeping day. I'm about to clean some glassware, glass pipes, glass bongs, glass dab rigs. But before I do that, I just wanted to remind everybody to hit that YouTube subscribe button and the notification bell because I upload new videos every Wednesday. Okay, we're going to clean some glassware today, and the first thing you have to do if you're going to clean your glassware is to gather your supplies. Now, it's nothing too exotic. I've got here everything we're going to need. You may or may not need everything I've got here, but these things are all handy when it comes to cleaning your glassware. So I'm going to start off with some 90% or higher alcohol. This is some grain alcohol that I got at a local Botanica store. But you can also go to the drugstore and get 90 proof or higher rubbing alcohol. That's going to work a lot better than say the 60 or 70% low cost alcohol you usually get at the drugstore. Get the 90% or higher because that's going to really dissolve all this gunk that is stuck onto our glassware. Now if your pipes or bongs are not too dirty, you can forgo the alcohol and actually use Dawn dishwashing liquid. This stuff is great at dissolving all kind of gunk, so if it's not built up too much, you can forgo the alcohol and use some Dawn instead. Now what I also have here is some sea salt or some Epsom salts, either one, and what these do is they kind of act like agitators in the pipe. So we're gonna put them in the pipe along with the alcohol or the Dawn and shake it up and that's going to break loose any kind of gunk that's clinging to the side of our pipes. And if there's anything stubborn, some pipe cleaners, a pipe poker, or some Q-tips can help you get it off the last little bits of everything hanging on your pipe. And of course, some paper towels are handy and some gloves. Cleaning nasty pipes and bongs is dirty work. You're gonna wanna wear some gloves, trust me. Now over the years, I've tried a lot of commercial pipe cleaners that have been sent to me as samples. And I gotta say, for my money, nothing works better as this 90% alcohol. So I usually forgo the commercial pipe cleaners and just get 90% alcohol, or as I said, Dawn, if it's not too dirty. Today we're going to be cleaning these glass pipes. And I did something you should never do. I let these pipes get dirty. I let these pipes get really dirty. In fact, I let some of them get disgustingly dirty for the purpose of this demonstration. Now, the dirtier your pipes are, the harder they are going to be to clean. So clean your pipes often and you won't have to work as hard. Okay, let's get cleaning these pipes. I always begin any glass cleaning project by first rinsing with hot water. This will get rid of any big particles before we get down to the real cleaning. Fill the pipe with hot water, cover the exit holes with your fingers, and shake vigorously. Rinse and repeat a few times. Wow, look at all that crud that comes out. Next, put your pipe or pipes into a container that you will fill with alcohol so they can soak. I like to clean a bunch of pipes at once, but you might only have one or two. Pour in some alcohol and make sure you use enough to fill the inside of the pipe bowl. For long stem pipes like the Chameleon Glass Gandalf pipe here, it's not necessary to totally submerge the pipe. We'll clean one side, then turn it over and allow the rest of the pipe to soak. Let your pipe soak in the alcohol for an hour or more. After soaking, it's time to give things another rinse. Shake up a mixture of alcohol and hot water and rinse. Shake strongly, then drain. Wow, that is some ugly looking water coming out of that pipe. Repeat this process a couple of times. If your pipe is not completely clean by now, add an agitator such as coarse salt or Epsom salts along with a little more alcohol. I've also used uncooked rice for this purpose in the past. The agitators act as little scrubbers and get rid of any debris still clinging to the glass. After adding an agitator, add a little more alcohol. Cover and shake vigorously, and in theory, the agitator will scrub any remaining gunk from your glass. Add more alcohol and repeat, if needed, to clean extremely dirty pipes. Keep repeating until most all of the dirt is gone. Give it another rinse. The bowl itself might still be dirty. To clean this, dip a piece of paper towel in alcohol and simply clean it away in a single pass. Now sometimes you will still have a couple of stubborn black bits clinging to your glassware. If that happens, take a pipe cleaner or a cotton swab, dip it in alcohol, and use it to dislodge any last dirt. 
Give it all another hot water rinse and your pipe should be cleaned as good as new.